Palmyra Atoll National Wildlife Refuge in the Central Pacific is remote, isolated, and near pristine. Located a thousand miles south of Hawaii, its use by the U.S. Navy during World War II caused significant change to its natural environment. But 75 years later, Palmyra has made a remarkable comeback, thanks to the protection offered by the partnership of the Nature Conservancy and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. As a result, Palmyra today is a unique living laboratory, providing scientists a baseline free from human impact to study coral reef resilience, climate change, invasive species, and much more. Yet despite this unprecedented protection, Palmyra faces a serious threat to its reefs. Iron leaching from a shipwrecked fishing vessel resulted in a large area of black reef caused by green algae and a coralomorph, an anemone-like invasive species that smothers coral and destroys related ecosystems. In 2014, the Fish and Wildlife Service spent more than $5 million in several months removing the wreck. While the area surrounding the wreck is recovering, the coralomorph has spread to Palmyra's southern and southwestern four reefs. The Nature Conservancy, Fish and Wildlife, and researchers from Scripps Institute of Oceanography are monitoring the coralomorph bloom and seeking ways to reverse its spread. Help from the Benioff Ocean Initiative will help us assess how best to control the coralomorph and then implement a coralomorph control plan to restore the affected reefs. In so doing, we will gain valuable information for coastal communities in Micronesia, Tanzania, and elsewhere in the world that are experiencing similar problems. As the Nature Conservancy's only scientific research station, Palmyra unites a wide range of scientific, governmental, and nonprofit partners to do more, better, faster through the Palmyra Atoll Research Consortium. By supporting this project, the Benioff Ocean Initiative will add its considerable expertise to restore Palmyra's reefs and demonstrate how our precious ocean resources can be effectively managed today and in the future.